Welcome to the channel of Butterflies and Things. Today we're looking into making wigs. Okay, but for an advanced fan, uh, uh, doll owner who makes clothes and is really into DIYing, now wants to start making wigs. Um, I don't think you have to start with with clothes first. There's no? there's people who actually went straight for the wigs because wow. they 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 thought it was a good idea. I'm I'm <laughs> highly impressed. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Uh, making Very a wig, cool. I think what you need is a lot of patience yeah. and willing to to do fiddly bits. Yeah. And you're looking uh, at every strand. Yeah. yeah. And mm -hmm. um, uh, I have another wig. Um, um, when you actually get a wig, I forgot that in the, in the other one. When you get a wig, um, there's usually a hairnet around it, a net like that. Mm -hmm. um, that this is when you buy a wig commercially, and we just did a video on that. It's online somewhere. So, you get it. Oh, d does it come with the ball? No, it does not always come with the ball. If it's like sent in one of these, sometimes they have like a wooden, a cardboard piece that will uh, keep it sort of as, as a package instead of a flat thing. But I always put uh, a ball in. I didn't have a ball of the right size, so you need a bigger ball actually. Uh, just to make sure that from lying down, this part doesn't get scrunched because it's it's actually hard. And if it gets like like uh, uh, mm. uh, folded, it doesn't unfold anymore. Yeah. So that's on on keeping uh, uh, storing a wig. Make sure that it has plenty of room. But so the the hardening over there is to keep the the top end like the the most prominent part. Yeah, because in she's shape. Yeah, because this is, is a bangless. Uh, this is one with a side part and not bangs. So mm -hmm. uh, uh, with a with a with one with bangs, which is oh this one. Excuse me. Let me steal your wig and your head. <laughs> <laughs> Rolling heads. Uh, oh well. <laughs> this one has 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 bangs. Um, so the weft is basically all the way in rows. I don't know if you can see that. Can you see yeah, that? Yeah, it's black yeah. on black. Yeah. It's in rows here. And if I try to put my finger in the row. Yep. Here you have two rows of wefts and then one more and another one, another one. Yeah. So to make the bang. But with the center part, um, you need to make the parts. So they have a, uh, have a, have a set piece. Which is rooted by hand, by hand or by a good machine. Mm -hmm. uh, in 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 a in a factory, it will be a machine, of course. Yeah. And, and which does not have any weft uh, rows. It's all singly rooted hair, or okay. in little clumps. You can see it's in little clumps here. And this is is this done in the factory by hand, or is this an automated? Uh... Um, that you know, factory is people say oh it's made in a factory and then think that nobody does anything yeah it's never but that's never true. not always true when no there's there. somebody no, sitting here making sure that this this, this actu end is actually works perfectly mm -hmm. there's somebody doing his work on it on individually yeah. he's just doing it very fast with really good machines yeah that's yeah, what a factory yeah. does sure and then another person um is doing uh, sewing up the weft so that's why i picked up this wig because it shows it's the weft really oh, nice oh yeah so this is a weft that it's a it's awesome. a row of of these these little rooted hairs yeah and let me see if i can put my finger through here yeah yeah yeah, yeah. and so and there is your next oh, one this is actually double one uh, there you go and um, so that's wow and then the next row and then and the next row every single one in. yeah and you go as you can see here around and around and around so yeah. so the center part is here so then that's the what first the lines row. are is is on the outside yes each row of of weft single being sold. single strands of hair yes uh, not the, the strands the, the weft yeah the weft the weft it's called the weft hair, yeah and um so you can actually do that yourself the wefts are actually you can buy them yeah, I could. I, I don't know a little sewing, and I could see myself doing that. What I yeah. could not see myself doing is this, unless I get very clear instruction. Uh, it's uh, it's done with uh, like a, a crochet needle. Yeah. Um, you can't see it here, but it's a, it's like a mesh like this. Uh, so you take the 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 piece of uh, the, you can see it's like a little clump of hair, like five yeah, or six strands, yeah. and then like with the crochet needle, you just crochet it in like a tapestry. Mm -hmm. And uh, and you go on and on and on. It's yeah. just very small tapestry. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> and uh, so this one has been covered up with another piece uh, of um, 
it's just uh, thickening area and then they've covered it with a, a mesh another mesh yes yeah so it didn't need to be a mesh here you can actually can you see through it yeah pretty much yeah oh yeah <laughs> Uh, so if you have patience, um, there's videos on people who ha how to do it. Yeah. Again, mm -hmm. uh, human hair, uh, I mean, uh, wigs for humans, wigs for dolls, same thing, different, om only a little bit of different scale. This this wig, this, this center part part, um, you look up how to make that for a human wig, same thing for, for a doll wig. Yeah, and um, can you get actual human hair oh yes you can even there's there's tutorials on how to make the these wefts yeah so uh, you have to make them first of you course. have to make yeah. them first um you can be done with a sewing machine that's it's just it's just a technique you, you look mm -hmm. it up mm -hmm. uh, make the wefts and then sew the weft onto the cap in whichever way you like and you mm -hmm. can have any color any type anything and, and the more lines you make the and the closer you put them together, the, the thicker, thicker your your th uh, your cousin will be. <laughs> Indeed. Sorry, I have to zoom out now. <laughs> but um, uh, that would also make if you want to do something like we had this little cute one here. That is quite uh, different layers, and uh, there's an English word for this, but it's uh, to to uh, cut in layers as well. So it comes across really nice. Yes, having all those layers because you can. Yes, what what you here that stops there and it has a beautiful uh, head of hair in this way. Yeah, it's a, it's a hairdo. You can actually uh, cut uh, uh, a doll uh, wig's hair. Um, it's very difficult. I have to warn you. Um, mm -hmm. It's very unforgiving because it will not grow back. If you make a mistake, it's it's there forever. You can really mess up yeah. one of these wigs. But if yeah. you try with a, with a very cheap wig. Um, it's uh, the hair has a direction which is more strong than you can see. I can do that, mm -hmm. and, and it, it just comes flops back every single time. Yeah, yeah, and so that's not human hair. Hair is is more forgiving. Mm -hmm. um, some of them are are heat resistant, and you can style them mm -hmm. up to a point. Heat resistance only means that you can apply some heat, not any major mm -hmm. amount of heat. Yeah. Um, so it's not heat proof. <laughs> it's not heat proof. I would not. <laughs> Just resistant, just a little bit. Just a little bit enough that it can it can actually put a put a, 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 a bit of a wave in it like this, or of a bit of a curl in it like so like, like this one. With human hair, when you lose a curling curling iron, that goes away after the next time you've. Uh, oh, this is going to stay put. Washed your hair, but yeah. This, this is, is going to stay with permanent curling iron. <laughs> yeah, I, I, I think straightening. Do not use curling iron on. The no, no, curling iron, iron is going to be hot, too hot. I, I, I would like. I would say go get, uh, go look at a whole bunch of tutorials and get some information yeah. on what other people do, and go with the lowest setting of the yeah. lowest setting of the lowest setting oh, first. Yes, yes. <laughs> Because once the uh, the the, the grey uh, smoke comes off your thing, yes. it's over, <laughs> and then it starts to smell a little like yeah. Burnt, and I'd start uh, with plastic, so. yeah. Start with straight and go towards curly. I don't think you can go from curly back to straight. Don't I don't oh, no straightening. No, I would okay. say no. So that doesn't work like no. human hair because no, no, you no. can human it's hair plastic. with a straightener. You can beautifully straighten it. It's plastic. It will not stay there after you've washed it, of course. But yeah. Uh, no, no, this is plastic and it, so it will rather... It is very permanent. Yeah. Everything you do may be permanent to this to these hair uh, weeks. And you will yeah. not go back to straight. That's not going to happen. Mm -hmm. Just forget yeah. that. So, yeah. um, But there are wefts that actually have the curl already in them. So mm -hmm. if you start, start with a weft like that and then uh, carefully comb it with, with technique of starting at, at the bottom and then recurling the, the, the curl as it comes off. Mm -hmm. And... Um, you can do something like that. Uh, this this is a Chinese wig, which needs some brushing, which mm -hmm. I will do at some point. Mm -hmm. And I believe this one's also Chinese. It's not a very good wig because it actually has what these kind of spots in it. If you if you wear it and and the hair just falls apart and it needs more. Yeah, and then you see the actual construction. Weft. Yeah. And that is not so nice. That's like when your hair falls open <laughs> and and you just see a bunch of uh, it scalp, and <laughs> that's not the point where you intended it. It means it's so a little it's short on weft. It could have used yeah, a little bit more weft, yeah, yeah, but it's yeah. already quite full. So do they? Uh, because when you comb them, they you probably will pull out some hairs. Do they actually use density after a while? Uh, you should 
comb in such a way that you will pull as few hairs as possible. Mm -hmm. um, but you can actually go quite quite a ways with that. Um, I, I don't. I mean, yeah, you lose a couple of hairs every time you you, you comb. Okay, but, but it's not not like they they start thinning out. Actually. If you come back in 15 years after combing sure. so many times. But that by yeah. that time your doll is a little on the yellow side. Yeah, my you yellow may have doll. changed the outfit 15 times as well. Yes, so. and then I give her a new wig. Yeah. With wigs always go from the front to the back. So hook on the front and go on the back. Is it any, ah, looks, she always looks very pretty whatever you do with her. Yeah, she, <laughs> she's quite, uh, quite the princess. Yeah. <laughs> She's got it going. <laughs> Absolutely. Yeah. Yeah, and um, so that's that's when you when you have wefts. If you like, um, uh, I actually should have started with this, but there you go. Oh, this is <laughs> the, the actual easiest make it yourself. Work. Yeah. So basically, uh, fun fur with a little bit of color, and uh, uh, you either draw a bold cap uh, pattern yourself, or you can download one and then fi make it to fit fit your doll. Uh, and then so very simple yeah uh, turn over put it on the dolly yep. yeah and there we go choose a head that can really carry that off which this one totally can and that's hello that's simple we have lift off oh yeah and fun fur yeah fun fur uh, i would suggest uh, the softer fun fur mm -hmm. Um, if, you, if you try to get like closer fur, it's actually harder to make the edges uh, credible because mm -hmm. the, the edges, of course, they look like that. So you put some yeah. hair over oh, it yeah. and you don't see it so much. Yeah, well, I thought, I think it looks okay. But, uh, but uh, you can, of course, upgrade that to uh, actual fur. Oh. Like, uh, oh, okay. Yeah. Tibetan wool, uh, Tibetan llama wool, and that sort of thing. Wow. And you can either use it with the pelt itself, so use the pelt as the base, like for the fabric, so this becomes the pelt, mm -hmm. or uh, you use it as hair loose and either make a weft or root straight onto a uh, one of these bases. Yeah. Or both if you want to do like a side part. Uh, uh, um, uh, a center part like this so this is rooted root this this part is rooted straight on and and th these are all the rest is all sewn yeah and the reason that you don't want to root the entire doll is because it's a lot of work <laughs> so where would you get uh, the actual uh, hairs uh, this kind of material uh, on Etsy or eBay hmm, or on Etsy Oh yes, okay. they sell them just the weft, uh, the weft complete or hairs that you can make into weft, mm -hmm. uh, the uh, the wool, uh, the pelts, uh, dyed. Um, some people dye dye the pelts. Uh, that's a whole different story, dyeing pelts. And um, I would do some serious research before you do that. I would suggest buy a nice colored pelt first, mm -hmm. and and then think about dyeing it. Now I want to dye it my own colors. Mm. It's it's a whole different completely different uh, subject again. Oh, okay. Different video. <laughs> different video. Did, we'll yeah. do that sometime. <laughs> no, 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 probably not. <laughs> oh, we won't. Unless people really want to see that. Uh, what I know about it, it's just a completely different thing. It's like, wow. like saying, okay, you make clothes and you want to also dye the fabrics. That's simply a different sure. subject. Yeah, yeah, okay. Gotcha. And yeah. uh, so I suggest if you want to do it with a pelt, uh, there's some really nice colored, dyed colored mm. pelts out there. Try that first and then... Yeah. Uh, Upgrade yourself later. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> if it turns out you're not too busy with just rooting hair all day long. Yeah. <laughs> and where's the best place to start? If you've not had, you know, you can maybe, you have some skills, but you haven't done this yet. Uh, research YouTube uh, and also uh, pages on, on internet of people who've done uh, human, ha human wigs. Human wigs. Uh, human wigs, human wigs. Be, human wigs tend to be with actual human hair, isn't it? And not always. No, no. Okay. Uh, that's the more expensive wigs, but the fun wig, the fun, uh, the fun wigs with interesting colors is not going to be human hair. Mm -hmm. So uh, true. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You've got the party wigs and uh, yeah, 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 exactly. Yeah, yeah. And and how to make your own and, party wig. And I want and the purple hair wigs. <laughs> and I want a special hairstyle for a cosplay kind yeah. of wig. And when people say, oh, I want to do it myself, all these yes. things apply to to doll wigs as well. Yeah. Uh, it's so just smaller. It's just smaller. So also, 
it should take less time to do a doll wig? Uh, in yes, in, in, in literally in, covering <laughs> a lot less ground indeed. across yes. the scalp. Yes. Yeah. Um, but I think yeah. Yes. <laughs> so it's also it. It seems to me that uh, a lot of the wigs tend to be voluminous. Yes, uh, it's because it's because, easier. Because because of that, because once you put stuff in, it's actually you know it bulks up much faster than. Uh, yeah, the the thing about uh, about a wig like this and a wig like that is the work to to actually root all the hair and put on the weft is yeah, exactly same, the, same. the same. Even yeah. if this one is that much longer, yeah, you know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Uh, this one's just uh, so short wigs are not necessarily cheaper than long wigs. No, uh, mm. only if if the material is like significantly more expensive than it, yeah. then then there's a different price difference. But the actual labor difference is no difference mm -hmm. between these two. And when you're making it yourself, you're looking at labor. You're looking at hours. Yes. Um, I do you know you and I know some people who actually made wigs and uh, yeah they, they love it. Yeah, you can. Uh, of, um, Talk about somebody who makes work. A friend of ours who uses a uh, um, wool from uh, for, for for knitting, yeah. and then she roots that onto a scalp cap like that, and then combs it out. And you can get roughly something like this. Just it, it's it's different. You can see it's different. It becomes pelty. It becomes pelty. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, and uh, but she good. she does all all that work. Uh, yeah, she loves it. <laughs> so uh, you know you can get a lot of joy out of that, or other people crochet, yeah. which also takes a lot of time. And, yeah, uh, yeah, excellent. Anything else you'd like to? No, nope, I think for, um, for yeah. If you if making you, of your wigs, well, um, care and feeding of your made wigs. Yeah. Um, Washing just make sure that it's that it's not never hot never hot never anything hot to, uh, next to your wigs basically uh, Look warm water would that be fine? Yeah, or yeah. just cold tap? No, look warm is fine. It's just yeah. make sure that I mean cold can be uncomfortable to your hands It doesn't need to be that it's just not yeah. not doesn't need to be anything like warm. Yeah, okay <laughs> look bo look Not body temperature. No, 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 no. <laughs> Yeah, because it's not real hair and when it is real hair, you're still dealing with the the skull cap Yes, area. skull cap yeah. is full of lycra or some other elastic and that doesn't deal with heat very well either. Yeah. Okay. Well, so uh, that is uh, a lot to take in, especially for somebody like me who has not even ever considered making. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just glad when I get my own hair <laughs> hey, don't have, You don't have to re your hair. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> If you like this video, please give us a thumbs up. And if you want to subscribe to the channel, we'd be very, very happy. Uh, ring the bell to get regular updates when we upload a video. And if you have a question, please send it along here or on the Facebook group. And we'd love to get to questions and see you later next time. Bye.